And those reports have become official straight from the Vatican just moments ago. That announcement coming at 6 a.m. And an announcement like this, it comes straight from the Vatican, straight from the Pope. And the 58-year-old uh, Bishop Perez hasn't been with us very long here in Cleveland. He was appointed as the 11th bishop in Cleveland back in September of 2017. He took over for Bishop Richard Lennon when he was forced to retire early with vascular dementia, the first Latin American to lead Northeast Ohio's largest region. His tenure saw him employ a warm pastoral approach with members of the church as well as his dealings with the fallout from the child sexual abuse scandal that took place under some of his predecessors and he's going to be going to a place that he knows very well he went to seminary in philly he was also a pastor at two parishes parishes in philadelphia as well and just like here he will be the first hispanic bishop there in Philadelphia and this is considered a promotion for Bishop Perez. His appointment could also hold significant power as every Philadelphia Archbishop since 1918 except for their most recent one has been named a Cardinal by the Vatican and for us here in Northeast Ohio it's unknown when Pope Francis will name Perez's replacement here in Cleveland but it is now official from the word of the Vatican opening uh, putting out on their website uh, that Archbishop uh, that Nelson Perez will be the new Archbishop of Philadelphia Dave. Boy, I'll tell you, Austin, you know, you said promotion, so great for him, but I'm, I'm sad, though, too, to lose him. He's such a great person. He truly is a leader, and with my dealings with him, he was so reassuring. No matter when the times were down, you could count on him. And also, Austin, you know what else? He's a fan of this show, so we're really going to miss him. Yeah, absolutely, and I remember being uh, seeing him this summer, and he was like, oh, can I take a selfie with you? I'm like, you want to take a selfie with me? I want to take a selfie with you. He was just yeah. a real person. He was accessible, and I think that's what we're really going to miss here in the community, not just the Catholic community, but here in Northeast Ohio in general. Absolutely. Well said. All right, Austin, thanks for that.